Hello everyone, welcome to Agnew Designs. This video will help you to understand the workflow for making an isometric room in Blender. First step, do some rough drawings and mark all dimensions in it. I do this because it helps me to keep focus on modeling without any distractions. Next step is to find camera settings to achieve the true isometric view in Blender. From these calculations, I got the angle for placing camera as 54.735 degree from x axis and 45 degree from z axis. Also here we need orthographic view of the room. So change the lens type to orthographic in camera settings. Now let's see the modeling part. Here there are a lot of things to visualize. So I hope you will enjoy this part with some good music in background.
now let's see some of the important routes and settings that I have used in this project. For adding this window, I have used the Archipack add-on. It's a very useful add-on which is already present in printer, but you have to enable it in preference. And it will be located at the end panel create tab. And here you can choose a window type and adjust the dimensions accordingly. Next, this plan, which is merely using an add-on called Molder Tree, which is an external add-on that you have to download, install, and enable it in preference. It's a node-based tree creation add-on, which you can open in node editor and tweak settings for making a small tree. And most of the material used in this project are based on principal BSDF. And there is a website called cgbookcase.com where you can download textures and also learn how to use PBR textures properly. Now let's see the lighting part. First I have added a LED lamp near this window which will act as a light portal to remove noise by getting rays from the environment through the openings where portal is positioned and added 3 spotlights with high power to mimic the morning sunlight and shadows and highlights are handled using planes like this one and also added an HDR image for background